Hello students. In this video, we shall find the slope of the tangent in polar coordinates. Now, a curve C is given to us. Now, this is a tangent for this curve. And this is the radius vector. So, all remember, now this is the radius vector. And here we have a tangent at this point. So, tangent at this point will... Uh, give us the uh, radius I mean now uh, will give us the angle between the radius vector and the tangent so that is different and that angle we have taken as phi so this will give us the angle between the tangent at this point and the radius vector which is phi which, which we saw in the previous video now OA will be the initial line okay so now the angle between this initial line and the tangent gives us the slope of the tangent. Now, we take that to be xi. So, the slope of the tangent xi is equal to the angle between the radius vector and the tangent plus the angle theta. What is theta? Theta is the angle between the initial line and the radius vector. So now theta is the angle between the initial line and the radius vector. Phi is the angle between the radius vector and the tangent at that at the point where the radius vector crosses the curve. And then xi is the angle between the tangent at a point and the initial line. Now in this problem they are asking us to find the slope of the tangent. The slope of the tangent is given by the angle between the tangent and the initial line which is xi and that is equal to the sum of the angle theta that is the angle between the radius vector and the initial line plus uh, the angle between the radius uh, vector and the tangent which is phi. So this will give us the slope of the tangent. Now to find this first we should know what is phi. Phi is given by we know that tan phi is equal to r multiplied with d, d theta by dr. Now from this we will find phi and that phi we will be substituting here and then we will obtain the value of xi which is the slope of the tangent. So let us solve a problem of this kind. Now here in this question they are asking us to find the slope of the tangent with the initial line for the cordioid r equal to a multiplied with 1 minus cos theta at the point theta equal to pi by 6. So let us do this problem now. So our first step will be what? Actually the question is to find the slope of the tangent which is equal to xi and that is given by theta plus phi. So our first step will be to find this phi and then substitute here. Now so to find phi, what, will, what is the formula that we will be using here? We will use tan phi is equal to r multiplied with d theta by dr. So for that first we should find d theta by dr. So let us consider the given curve r. So what is r? r is equal to a multiplied with 1 minus cos theta. And so this can be written as a negative a cos theta. Now what we will do, we will differentiate on both the sides with respect to theta. So when we differentiate here we have r. So this will become dr by d theta is equal to the differentiation of a is 0 because it is a constant negative. This a is in multiplication so we have to write it. What is the differentiation for cos theta? It is negative sin theta. And so dr by d theta will be equal to negative sine multiplied with negative sine will become positive and so it will be a sin theta. Now this is our dr by d theta but actually what we want in the formula d theta by dr. So we will take d theta by dr which will be equal to the reciprocal of this value which is 1 by a sin theta. So now we have obtained d theta by dr. Let us substitute in this formula. So when we substitute there, tan phi will be equal to r multiplied with 1 by a sin theta. And so now as per the question what is r that we have to substitute here. 
r is a multiplied with 1 minus cos theta so we have to give the substitution here so a multiplied with 1 minus cos theta divided by a sin theta now this a and this a gets cancelled and we will be left out with 1 minus cos theta divided by sin theta now as per the trigonometric formula we know that 1 minus cos theta is equals to 2 sin squared theta by 2 and also sin theta can be written as 2 sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2 these are trigonometric identities now using these identities what we get is we can make that substitution and so our tan phi will be equal to now instead of 1 minus cos theta we will write it as 2 sin squared theta by 2 so 2 sin squared theta by 2 divided by instead of sin theta we will write it as 2 sin theta by 2 cos theta by 2 now here 2 and 2 gets cancelled and here we have sin squared so one of the sin theta gets cancelled and so we will be left out with sin theta by 2 divided by cos theta by 2. So what is sin by cos? It is tan. So this will be tan theta by 2. So now here we have tan phi to be equal to tan theta by 2. So taking tan inverse on both the sides, we can equate the angle that is phi is equal to theta by 2. So we have obtained 5 here that is theta by 2 now actually what we want we want xi isn't it so if you see here we want xi so xi is equal to what theta plus phi now phi is just now we have found it to be theta by 2 and so the lcm here will be 2 and so it will be 2 theta plus theta which is 3 theta so xi is what 3 theta by 2 but what is theta given in the question? Theta is given to be pi by 6. And so when we substitute that 3 by 2 multiplied with instead of theta we have to substitute pi by 6. And this gets cancelled 3, uh, 2 times is 6 and so that will be equal to pi by 4. So therefore the slope of the tangent xi is equal to pi by 4. So this is the answer. So I mean this is the angle. So slope of the tangent will actually be equal to. So slope of the tangent for this uh, question. Actually it is equal to tan xi. So slope of the tangent is given by tan xi which is equal to tan pi by 4. But what is the value of tan pi by 4? As per the trigonometric formula it is equal to 1. And hence the slope of the tangent with the initial line for the cardioid is 1. So uh, here I have given the angle for the thing that is actually angle xi is equal to theta plus phi but actually what is the slope? Slope is equals to tan xi so you should remember that. So do not confuse this as slope this is the angle xi so slope is actually equal to tan of xi. So this is the uh, slope of the tangent with the initial line for the cardioid and that um, gives us uh, therefore the final answer will be slope of the tangent with the initial line so initial line of the cardioid so this is equal to 1. So this is the answer. So the slope of the tangent is 1. Hope you have understood this problem. Thank you.